happy evening of the 13th of December. I have just uploaded my Vlogmas Day 13, which I finished off today uh, filming for. And now this will be for Vlogmas Day 15. So I hope you guys are all doing really well. Have you enjoying my Vlogmas so far? So I am just going to show you a little bit of what I'm doing. And I will briefly continue to show that this evening. But I've just lit two candles. So it is Sparkling with Spice, uh, Winter Warmer. And then the Yankee Candle Christmas Eve candle. I love these two. So I've got those on. And I'm going to be doing this green tea sheet mask from the mask bar. Um... Yeah, so that's what I'm going to be doing as a part of self-care because I've just not been looking after myself and because of that I am getting really exhausted and I shouldn't be running myself down, which is what I'm doing, I'm just doing too much. So I just thought, right, I've been filming non-stop every day, um, so I am still filming and I'm still working tonight, but it's more of a relaxed way, so I'm not, I'm vlogging rather than sitting down doing the videos, so it just makes a massive difference. So what I wanted to show you today was something that I actually already filmed for you all but um, I accidentally deleted it. So this is my children's Christmas box. I don't give it to them on Christmas Eve like traditionally a lot of people do. I give it at the beginning of December just so that they can actually use everything. Plus Christmas Eve for us is quite a busy day and evening where we do a lot of traditional Italian and Polish things which I can talk to you about another time. But yeah, I'm just going to show you what I did. This isn't how exactly it was presented. It was a little bit better than this. Um, but yeah, so I've gone a lot less than what I've normally done years before. I've gone a little bit crazy. But I've reined it in. And um, yeah, so if I show you their PJs first. So Fiorella's pyjamas are from Matalan. And they are just a really gorgeous, soft, traditional... I don't know how what you call this style of pyjama, but where it's got like a collar... And these little buttons and this is the print and it's just so pretty with these little trousers i just loved these i found christmas pjs really hard to get hold of this year i don't know why but all the other years there have been loads and loads of choices whereas this year i just found that there weren't maybe because there just wasn't a lot that i liked but yeah these were really good and i think these were eight pounds in matalan and then i also got nellos from there and nellos is the exact same style but his is like got a little train on with like a Christmas tree and then another like little Christmas tree pattern here, which I thought was really cute. And they are so, so soft and again around eight pounds. And then these are Raffi's. I actually had to get these out of the wash <laughs> to show you, but these are Raffi's. So he has a Christmas, uh, Father Christmas here that's got a fairy beard. And these are the trousers. Um, these were a lot more money. These are 14 pounds. And I did find that, I think they're about 14 pounds. I do find that this year PJs are a lot more money, Christmas PJs. Um, which is a real shame because they don't need to be, but unfortunately I've just found them to be really expensive this year. So, um, yeah, so I got those for him. And this is the actual box. I can't remember where I got it from. I'm not sure whether it was um, eBay, I think it might have been. I'll see if I can find it somewhere. I'll find the link and, and pop it in the description box below for you all. But that's the um, the front of the box, which is, I really loved it. And it's like a crate, like a wooden crate, and it fits loads in, so it's really good. But let me just show you briefly what I got them. Okay, so I got them these two Magic Snows. Uh, they love these. We always have fun with these. And this is actually leftover from last year. Um, but I just got them this one this year. And you can get them for about a pound from the pound shop or even less if you go to like Home Bargains or B&M. You just literally add water and then basically it expands and it feels like real snow. It's amazing. So I got them those to play with. Then I also got them, oh that's handy isn't it, from B&M, I got this mini gingerbread men set. So these biscuits are already made, you get five packs and you get two icing pens and basically they can create their own design. So this was on offer like before December. So these are the little gingerbread men packets that you get, um, so we haven't done it yet. And then these are the two icing pens so they can create whatever design they want. So I just thought that'd be really cool for us to do. So got that. And then I also got this, which is the snowman. Build your own snowman. Now, I thought this was like the snow, like the magic snow, but it wasn't. It's actually like kinetic sand. So um, you get some moulds, and then you get blue and white um, coloured sand. And then you get some glitter, and basically you can basically make the snowman, which I thought was really cute and something that they would love to make together. So we've got that. 
Then I got this from TK Maxx, which I love. Now, this is about $4.99, and it is a festive Christmas baking set, like utensil set. So you get this little, which look at how cute that is. So you get this little spatula, and then this larger one with Father Christmas on, and it's got all like, the measuring bits on the back, which is really good, because you I always need those. Then it had um, this cookie cutter here, which I think is like the shape of a... Um, like present I'm presuming but yeah it's like copper rose gold so there's that for us to do Christmas baking with then I got this book from last year and this is Baba and Father Christmas I actually got it to be cheaper than that because this bookshop closed down it was one of my favorite bookshops ever because you get amazing amazing books with such good value um such good prices so I got them that one last year to save for this year when it was closing down so I got through about a pound so yeah I got that and it's a hardback then I got them one each of these from um, Home Bargains, and they're £1.49. Now, I actually saw this in another shop, and they were £4.99 each. So it's such um, a good place to go, Home Bargains. Honestly, the things you can find in there, so it's £1.49. And yes, it's the Elf on the Shelf Christmas tradition with over 150 stickers, games, puzzles, colouring and more. And it's just really, really good and really handy if you want to go out and about and they can have this to kind of colour in. So look, there's a, Fidella's already added her little drawing in there, lover. She's, she's so good, bless her. So yeah, it's just like, there we go again. It's just really good for them to be able to kind of do drawing in and lots of activities and stuff. So they got one of those each. So we can take them out whenever we go out with them. Or they can just do them in, in here when it's like a rainy day, which you get a lot in the UK. Then I also got these two books. Now this is one that I've wanted for quite a while for them. Um, I saw some really good reviews on it and it's Pick a Pine Tree. It's a beautiful book. Honestly, I've read it to them and it's such a lovely book. I'd highly recommend this. The illustrations are gorgeous. The rhyming, the actual story of it, it's just lovely. So yeah, I got that from Amazon. So I'll link it below for you. Then I also got this from Home Bargains for 79p, which is amazing. And it's Have Yourself a Hairy Little Christmas. So I love to get them Christmas books each year. And then they've kind of got a real good collection. So then every Christmas time, I bring all the books out. And every day we choose books to read. Uh, so yeah, they've got this one, which is quite funny. They like it. Then I got this for them. And this was Home Bargains. And it is Sleigh Bells 3 Hanging Character Decorations. Now, I think this is actually what I got the elves to give them. But just like another idea for you guys to pop in your boxes if you wanted to. This was about 79p. It was amazing. So basically, they get three decorations and they're going to hang them up quite soon. And then the last thing, which I think is the last thing I got is this, which is from Home Bargains again, under three pounds, I think even probably cheaper. And it's make your own pom-pom tree, so which is really fun. Um, so we're going to be doing that this weekend. And basically it's got everything that you need inside, which is just perfect. And yeah, and then you can make yourself a pom-pom Christmas tree. So I thought that'd be lovely for them to do together. Um, so yeah, so that's what was it in my children's Christmas book. So I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing that. And um, yeah, let me know if you give your child one as well. I just, I just love stuff like this. 14th of December. So I haven't actually been vlogging, sorry, but I have my cousin coming over. So now what we're going to do is we are going to ice our gingerbread man. So you, so you move. No, is it Buona? Buona! Buona! So be good boy, que bravo. So this is the little gingerbread man which is really cool and then we're just icing them aren't we Fidella? so i got some mice here yeah. and i'm gonna make i'm gonna make a princess and this castle <gasps> well and, it, done. and it's gonna make oh, an ice what's really? this guys well done what are you gonna do with yours Rafi? how cool is it coming out that one please, please. Mello, are you going to swap the colour? Right, we are playing a snowball fight. Yeah, you only have five lives. I've only got five lives left? No, How's that for? Right, you ready? Ready? Incoming! Oh, 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 o
Yeah. Once. What? I'm sure it was more than once. No, it was not. I'm sure it was. No, it wasn't. Yeah. I won. Here you go. Here's an invisible one. I'm it's uh, kitchen chat time. Hello. So, Saturday the 14th of December. I cannot believe it's already the 14th. It's flying by. Um, I still need to wrap everything. We still need to get a few last bits, which we'll probably do over the next couple of days, order online. I'm just doing jack of potatoes and beans and cheese for dinner, just a real simple meal because we had pizza for lunch, so just something really simple. I was just like chuck in um, the oven and stuff. So yeah, we're gonna have that. And then I've already done bath time for the children, get them into bed at about seven, half seven, depends if they fall asleep though. And then, um, yeah, and then I, hopefully I can do some work and start some wrapping. Last night I had three and a half hours sleep. What you're saying? Hello, guys. So what I wanted to do, go go. What are you doing? Um, is I wanted to show you what I've got each child in their stocking. So instead of doing a sit down video doing it, I'm just gonna do it like this. What I'm gonna show you as part of a vlog. So. This is Nello's. Now this stocking was made by my amazing mama. She's so, so clever. So she's made each of the children's stockings. And then, yeah, on the top is always a cuddly toy, but it hasn't arrived yet, it's from eBay. So he has got the character Miguel from Coco. Don't know why, but I feel like something's missing, but I'm not sure what. <laughs> I hate it when that happens because I do start quite early with my Christmas shopping. Okay, so for Nello, I have got him these Toy Story 4 socks. And they were five pounds, but they were in like the um, like the Black Friday sale, or just before the Black Friday. Actually, they had a little sale on, and um, yeah, I got these in Tesco's, and he loves Toy Story, so he's gonna absolutely love these. Then I also got him one of these, uh, no, two of these even. So you get two little minis um, of the little Toy Story four characters. And I got him these paint sticks. Now these are incredible. These, they have these at a playgroup that we used to go to. And basically they have paints within these pens, but it's not messy at all. And it comes out like paint and dries really, really quickly. And yeah, he loves being creative at the moment. So he's gonna love those. Cause just watching, aren't you cakes? <laughs> and then I got him this from Tesco's, which is a UK supermarket. It's called Pair Up Sets. Now they have a memory game like this with my grand, uh, with my parents, not grandparents. And yeah, they love it. So I got him that. Now this was reduced. I can't remember how much, but it was much, much cheaper. So yeah, got him that game. Then I also got him this in my son. This was in the 30% um, off sale and it's just this big t-rex he's obsessed with dinosaurs so i got him that and then lastly i got him this from matan this wasn't a fiver this was less i think it's about three pounds in the end and it's dino world and it's just got loads of little dinosaurs so i'm going to see if i can fit everything in if not then i might take those out of that bag and i think i might take the socks out as well but yeah so that's his stocking for this year I hope you guys have enjoyed that vlog. Please do not forget to like and subscribe. And I will be starting another vlog straight after this. Uh, and I've got another video planned for tomorrow where it's probably going to be a sit down video. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Take care. Bye.